Here! Let's find Shen Lin and get the hell out of here. what you started to it. Wouldn't want to disappoint the other applicants. Now, our first candidate is a veteran of Peking. Now, what's that they say about old soldiers? <laughs> Frankly, my eyes on you. He's something of an old hand at handling explosives. Only man I know who hasn't <laughs> lost a limb working with them. <laughs> Yet. Fireman! Ah! <laughs> 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 Oh, 
is a former devotee of Lady Comstock. But without the old gal, they don't know quite what to do with themselves. Pick this one up at a hiring fair for a song. You hold on to this. interested in your job, Fink. Now, now, I know all about your little job for Fitzroy. But do you really want to take her offer over mine? Do you know how many people would kill to be head of Fink Security? <laughs> You're a tough nut to crack, Mr. DeWitt. A tough nut. <laughs> but <laughs> I promise you this. I will get what I want. Booker, there's a door over here. I think that's the way down. I had 
thought you a fool, dear brother, when you told me that you heard wonderful music trumpeting from holes in the thin air, I began to doubt your mental integrity. But not only have you made your fortune from these two dads, you have lit the path for me as well. interested in one like you wait fight look chen lin sell them the map Open this? Really? That little old lock. I used to work for folks like Fink. Really? Man, I was with the Pinkertons. They call us in when the workers got restless. To do what? Demonstrate the folly of men striking, throwing down tools. You hurt people. I'll tell you this. Sometimes there's precious need for folks like Fitzroy. Why? Because of folks like me. All done. Fitzroy, you goddamn gook. You know you can hear them. Oh, Ain't no privies down here. Treat them like oh. What could people have done to deserve to be locked up? Fink don't need much of a reason. No. No, he doesn't. It's Slate. He looks... You were right. Sparing him was no mercy. Take a look at this. I'll give it a whirl. This is it, isn't it? Yep. Number nine. There you go. Do it? You're a lion. But you can't blame me for looking after my own interests, can you? Now I know Fitzroy has come calling, but I think you'll find your business with her has come to an end. <laughs> lions walk with lions, do it? Now we need to find someone else to make those guns. No. Dead is dead, Elizabeth. Dead is dead. What? How the hell did... I see heads. And I see tails. It's all a matter of perspective. Why are you following us? Who sent you? Comstock? What do you want? What do you see here, from this angle? Dead. Listen. And that angle? Alive. Walker. Chen It was never here. It's another Columbia. A different Columbia. The same coin. A different perspective. Heads. Tails. Dead. Alive. We have to go through to this other Columbia. But how? It's like riding a bicycle. 
never really forgets. One just needs the courage to climb aboard. If we go into the stair, I don't think I'll be able to bring us back. Are you sure you're ready? Okay, open it. And no body. It's another world, Booker. Another Columbia. Something tells me one dead gunsmith ain't the only thing that's changed. Some help with this. I can do that. understand how Chen Lin is alive now. We're in a world where he was never murdered. Somewhere we'll find out why, I suppose. I don't suspect you can change something like that and have everything else remain the same. These men. I killed them. They were dead. I'm disgusting. Disgusting. Through their noses. They're, they're all bleeding. Being dead. What is oh, going on here, Sansmark? <laughs> my head of security. I suspect you're one to find out how these two slid <laughs> off your head and what they were doing in the basement. <laughs> This makes my head hurt. Cronies want for you? <laughs> uh, strike, they say. Uh, throw down your tools, they say. Why, I tell you, the moment you do, you will see what those hyenas are made of. I ask you, where are they going to be when it's cold outside and your boy's got the mumps and hey, you who is this on your but
great. Booker, catch! Appreciate it. Nice. I never heard that song before. Hear anything? Huh? No machines. No tools. Let's go find that gunsmith. Maybe he's upstairs now. The shrine. It's a figure of Comstock now. Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Excuse me, Chen Lin? Who are you? You speak up! Speak up! Can't hear you over all these machines! Very loud! I'm Booker DeWitt. Stand back! These machines very dangerous. Wait downstairs with Mrs. Lin. Uh, Daisy Fitzroy sent us. We need to talk to you about getting some weapons. Machines very dangerous. No place for stupid people. Want to lose pretty head? Mr. Lin, if... Downstairs! What is wrong with him? Remember him dead in that cell? Maybe in... in some way he remembers that too. How would you reconcile that? I don't know. Kill my husband? Calm his troubled thoughts. Ease his burden. Excuse me, ma'am. I'm looking for Mrs. Lin. I'm Mrs. Lin? No, I, I mean a little Chinese lady. She was... Booker, this is Mrs. Lin. They took Chen's tools. What's he got without his tools? Well, your husband is a bit out of sorts. If he could work again, maybe... If, if he could work, he'd... Mrs. Lin, can you tell me who took your husband's tools? Goddamn police. They took them and locked them up in the impound in Shantytown. Would having his tools back fix his mind? Who cares? But we're not getting any guns if Chen Lin doesn't have his tools. Let's head to Shantytown.
you notice? Lynn had a bloody nose. Seems to be in style. Miss Tara. I'm not so sure it was a good idea.